The 24-hour long raid by the enforcement directorate in Binish Kodiri's house ended after the well-appointed house witnessed high drama. The vehicles of ED officials and CRPF which were leaving the premises of the house after the raid were blocked by the Kerala police. Assistant Commissioner of Police said that they sought officials' explanation on the incident on the heels of the complaint filed by the relatives of Binish with the Pujapura police against the ED officials who were the inhumane treatment. And following the explanation, the vehicle was permitted to go. Binish's wife Renita told media that the agency had mentally traumatized her by forcing her to sign on some documents claiming the officials had recovered an electronic payment card in the name of Muhammad Anoop from the house. She also alleged that the card was brought by the officials and not found from the house. Binish's mother-in-law also told media the officers are lying on the credit card obtained from his room. When they found the card, they should have informed us. ED has also seized my iPhone and threatened to arrest us. They tried to harass us mentally. Binish's wife stood firm on her stand and told the officials that she will not sign the mahasa even if taken to jail. As Binish's wife accused the ED officials of denying the child's basic needs, the Kerala State Commission for Protection of Child Rights arrived at the spot said they will soon issue directions to ensure protection of Binish's two-year-old child who was present during the time of raid. The relatives who reached his house engaged in a verbal spat with ED officials as they requested to enter the house. The report said that Binish's wife refused to sign the papers related to the ED raid. As the spat between the ED officials and Binish's relatives were in progress, the relatives staged protest in front of Binish's house, Kodiri at Maridam Kodiri in Thiruvananthapuram, demanding to meet his wife, his two-year-old child and her parents inside the house. The Karnataka police did not permit the relatives who came with food and clothes to enter the house. The state police also arrived at the spot following the spat. When the officials denied the permission to meet those inside the house, the relatives started a sit-in protest outside the gate of the house. The relatives also said they will not leave the place without seeing them. They also alleged that it seemed that the members inside the house are under house arrest. A team of ED officials arrived at the residence of Binish Kodiri, son of CPM State Secretary Kodiri Balakrishnan, on Wednesday morning in connection with the probe into the money laundering related to Bangalore drug trafficking. The raid has been delayed indefinitely due to the confusions prevailed regarding the signing of Mahasa. According to the reports, the ED officials recovered a credit card belonging to Mohammad Anoop, arrested in Bangalore drug case, from Binish Kuriri's house. Meanwhile, Binish's wife alleged that this was brought by the ED officials. In that context, Binish's wife refused to sign the Mahasa documents. Binish's family will be moving to court against the ED. A lawyer arrived at the place on the instructions of the family, and he too was denied the entry to the house. As the dispute intensified, renowned lawyer Murukumura Vijaykuma, who handles CPM activist cases in the capital city, reached Binish's house. Though the raid entered Wednesday night, the prop team of ED didn't leave the house as Binish's wife refused to sign the Mahasa documents. News desk, Kaumati English.